Alrighty, what I'm going to do today is I'm going to teach you people how to find everything on the internet. I'm going to go through some basic rules here. A lot of people are going through torrents and line wire, so on and so forth, but I want to let you know that everything you need is here. Alright? Now, another thing I'm going to teach you, I'm going to try to teach you in 10 minutes anyways, is how to find gone or supposedly missing and lost files. Never, ever take no for an answer that you will, never, you will not find it. Even if the website's closed down, I don't give a shit. You're going to find it. And don't ever believe that shit can't be found. Keep in mind, there are millions of people out there that have the same file that you and I are looking for. <clears throat> Everything you need or want is here. I mean, I found AutoCAD is it here. <clears throat> Excuse me. Windows 7, all versions. Windows XP. Uh, one thing I do need from you guys, I really would appreciate it if you can send me links to Vista. People that have Vista up, because I can't seem to find that, because I don't know enough about Vista to be looking for it. And Windows 7 keys, I have only like five of them. Uh, XP, forget it, I have too many, but I, I, anyways, now here's another rule here, you must acquire all the information on your target program, you must know a lot about it, or start learning what you can, what format is it in, is it executable when you buy it, is it, is it a bat file, so on and so forth, now the next thing is, what's the abbreviated version, for instance, Windows XP Professional, so, you know, whatever, that's how you buy it, but what do people usually call it, winxp.iso, because it's an image, uh, what are there other people thinking when they put this out here on their servers or wherever they put it? You got to think like other people too, because this is how I found everything. Now, with those things in mind, oh yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna jump to something else really quick here. I know some of you don't run exactly legal operating systems, and you go to Microsoft and they want you to verify, or you just don't want your rights violated, and you don't get the uh, updates. Well, here you go. Um, here's Windows Service Pack three you I am highlighting it right here now one way to find that is not necessarily in Microsoft what you're gonna do is you're gonna highlight this I've already done it so I don't have to worry about it you copy it and you're gonna put it in a browser yeah for what reason you're wondering right well guess what we're gonna find it somewhere else and I'm gonna go down here I do it in google.ru I don't like the American version for some reason and here it is there's your Surface Pack 3. That works for any other file out there and include DLLs and everything else. You will find it in Google. Make sure you put the word index, okay? Now, in this search here, which one was this one I was doing? Okay, that's a repeat. All right, that's the site. Oh, another thing about music. It wasn't very hard to figure out how to find music. Just put in index because a lot of stuff's found in indexes where you can open for the public. Of Marilyn Manson, and obviously you want an MP3 format. And look what I found. Okay, while well, it's loading. Now, there's no excuse in the world why you can't find any of this shit. It is terribly easy. Okay, this, this site isn't loading. However, you get the point. And here we are. We have all these albums here, including Charles Manson. <laughs> all right. I, oh, that's right. He did the Lie album. Next, what we're going to do is we're going to show you a little puppies a little bit more on what to do on the internet. All right, here we go. My favorite way to search for things. I have many, many ways that I do it, but I'm going to put this out to you guys here. Anything you're looking for, make sure it is in quotations, index of, forward slash, quotations, and double quotations with whatever you're looking for in the middle, space, quotation, parent directory, space. All right. For instance, I'm looking for office, so I'm going to be a little bit more vague, can I be? No. Let's say office 2007. And sure enough, here's the French version. Here's the serial numbers. Here's a place to download it on another website. This applies to anything. Index is my favorite word to use, but if you really want to find a specific program, Paint Shop Pro 8, AutoCAD 2010, Fucking, I just can't think of many. I have literally over two hundred thousand dollars in software. I've been doing this for over ten years, and I find everything within twenty minutes what I want. And I don't just use Google; I use other search engines. So there's no reason in the world why you guys should be out there asking where to find shit. It's all in front of your face. Another thing that I was explaining to people, I was saying, try to think like other people do. A simple-minded person, for instance, will put it down as WinXP.ISO. So, sure enough, that's what I typed into Google, and look what I found. Windows XP ISO, it's about 700 megs. I mean, 
I don't even know what to say anymore. I pretty much just spilt it all out right here in the open here, how to use Google and other search engines. Just put what in you're looking for, you will find it. As I said, guys, there's millions and millions of people out there that have this shit just sitting there, and I probably only found a drop in the sea. And in case you're wondering, there is nothing illegal about what you're doing, I'm doing, and there's nothing illegal about what these people are doing either. Google has a right to, to have the search. You have a right to search engine, and it has a right to be here. Now, whether you have the right to take that and download it is completely between you and yourself and your conscience. Now, what I'm gonna quickly going to do <clears throat> is I'm going to introduce you to a few websites where you can get a lot of free shit. For people on XP, I would recommend going to this website here. It is winxp76.webs.com. They have a lot of Windows shit, mainly XP. Next, I'm going to bring you to Spain. And here it is, mocosoft.com forward slash principal.htm. That means you're going to bypass all that fucking disclaimer shit by doing that. Now, mind you, it's in Spanish, but the programs are in English. However, everybody knows how to use the Google right here. Here, I'll do it for you with the fish. Translate to English. And everything here is in English. Mind you, I don't know how many pages there is. There's at least 40, 50 pages, and I still have not touched what's in mocosoft.com. Uh, you guys want an example? Here we go. I'm scrolling down the page. It just goes on and on and on and on and on. Now, as far as freeware goes, there's some good sites out here. I'm going to show you one. It's pen drive applications. And don't let the name fool you. It's for pen drives. However, a lot of these things are not freeware normally. But once something is declared a freeware or a demo, they cannot tell you you cannot own it and you have to upgrade. Here we go. Here it is, pendriveapps.com with two Ps, but I think you can see it up here. And the categories are just imminent on the left-hand side. You name it, every category, stuff that is normally not free. Server, WinZip, FTP tools, graphics and design, media player, password managers, all this is freeware. Now I'm going to bring you to another website. Mind you, I found all this on Google. Very simple to do. One example I wanted to bring up really quickly. I helped these guys on this website. They had a thing called Blender X. And they said the website was closed. And I went and found the name of the file. We'll just say it was 123.zip. zip. I went and put that in the search engine. And I found it somewhere else in, in, in another country and all that shit. Anyhow, it's back on their website. Now, there's other people and other companies, for whatever reasons, unknowns to me. They'll take that, that, that file, and as I said, everybody has it somewhere else, and they put it up on their website, and I was, you know, managed to bring that back. So, as I said, this is a prime example, a small one, but don't take no for an answer, because everything you want is out here. Now, I'm going to bring you to another website. I believe it's um, server. Here it is, yes. Server76.webs.com. This guy's got a good amount of stuff in here. All right, I'm I'm, I'm not going to sit here and show you guys everywhere to go on the internet. That stuff you have to figure out on yourself. I pretty much gave you the basic rules and how to find it. Go looking for it. All righty. Um, on the last request, anybody who got Windows 7 keys, I would greatly appreciate it. If you guys have any questions and requests for files and you can't find them, I'll be I'll be glad to help you. So don't forget to sub me, which means to subscribe to me. You have a good one. Take care. Bye.